Hey guys, Kills of Thrills here, and we're back with some Sons of the Forest. Okay, patch 7 is out. This is it. Loads of new stuff, in case you haven't seen. We've got golf carts. We've got a massive cannibal currently standing there looking at me. Uh, we've got new building systems. We've got all updates to the stone. Let me just get rid of him. Stand by. Oh my god. Just, uh, what am I hitting him with? Feathers? Right. Anyway, he's done. So we've got new building things. So I figured we, I'm just going to have a little mess around. I'm on my test server. I figured we'll just give it a go and see what we've got. So one thing that we do have, we now have stone storage, which is ideal because we couldn't store it on anything other than the sledge, I'm afraid. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pump out a couple of them. Okay, so what we got? I mean, it doesn't look too fancy. Let's, uh, let's put some items in here, shall we? Let's see what it looks like. Oh, actually, I'm going to count them when we can get in here. One, two. Three. 26. You can get 26 stones in one of these, which is actually is quite a lot. I believe you can get 27 on the sledge, but 26 is still pretty good. That looks nice to me. I like that. I like the way that looks. That is great. Well, at least we can store the bloody things now instead of having about 100 million sledges sitting around the base. I'm going to see if the uh, the old duplicator works. Okay, so log is on the floor. Let's smash that out. Grab one of these and let's have a little look. Ah, you can't. Yeah, they fixed it. You can't do it. They fixed it. Although, you can now line up these to it. I didn't know if you could do that in the first place, but that is pretty cool. So they've added some other things to the book as well for the stone building. I was just wondering why it's so bright, but I think it's because... Um, Sun's behind my character right now. Let's have a look. See what's new in here. Apparently, that, ah, there we go. Stone building. It's all in the building book. You can build the walls. You can now build the doors, which is not what you use your axe to cut out the stone. So they're basically using the same system as that you would do. As if you were doing it out of wood, basically. So I feel like we should give that a go. Let's give that a go. Let's grab my, my stone. Let's put a let's put a foundation down. Let's um let's get one of these down. See if they'll allow us to put foundations down. See if we can fill up the bottom so we can actually have a stone floor. Because I know everyone's dying to get a stone floor on the go right now. I know I'm bloody dying to get a stone floor. No. You cannot. Okay, so you can't get the stone floor. But that's fine because I think they're gonna Can I get this up? That's that, right. Let's just smash out a quick wall and then we'll get into um, building the wall and doorways and the windows and stuff like that. Hold on, what? Wait. Oh, you can put stone struts in now. Oh, okay, okay. I like that. That You can only do it on one side, though. It's a bit weird. All right, we'll have a look at that in a second. Ooh. New building, new stone stuff. This is great. I want to own many more things that we're going to find out of this. Whenever they do this, there's always some sort of bug where uh, you can duplicate stuff or get loads of free things. I'm pretty sure I'll probably find that at some point. Right. Build a wall was not... Ah, uh, yeah, see, it's just the same. Get the floor down on this bloody thing. Right, we've got a floor. Let's get out. <laughs> it's, all right, it's, it's a bit weird. It is a bit weird. What did we get out of that? We get two stone. To be honest, it's actually better... Because uh, not only do we get the two stone, we can then use it again instead of just having, like, we can turn these stones into full beams. I like that. That's nice. Now, let's see if we can do different variations of that. Can I use that in there at all? I cannot. Okay, well, we can experiment with that, can't we? Let's increase this. Let's get something else in there. Get this floor back down and see what else we can do. Right, let's just set up something something else quite quick. Now, can I put... You can. But I can't do it too. I think it's because it's too short, but I can get them in there anyway. There's some struts, right. I'm going to fill this up. Just going to see what sort of windows we can look at, you know? See what sort of windows we can do. See, just seeing what designs we can come up with. Right then. Let's smash this out. I like that. That actually looks quite nice. I like 
the uh, the stone around it. Still can't get it quite high. Doesn't quite reach the top, I'm afraid. But it's still those gaps which are a tad annoying. Get them out of the way. Got stones everywhere. Move that as well. That looks all right. I like that. Let's fill the middle in and see if we can get something in there as well. Okay, well, that's interesting. So, you don't actually have to wait for it to be fully built to be able to knock something out. As you can see there, I've just taken out the bottom of that area. I'm about to get attacked by a crap ton of cannibals. Just let me go clean them up. Right, before I was rudely interrupted, never mind. You can actually cut them out whenever. You don't actually have to have a full wall in order to cut out the stones. So you don't have to have the windows at the top. Kind of like that. You can literally just cut them out whenever you like. Or wherever you like. Like I could take that one out there. Boom, done. I don't know why you'd want to hold that like that, but maybe you can use it for some sort of like lookout thing. Some sort of defense thing. Can I get in that? Nope, it's too low. There's a door there. Boom. Okay, yeah, that looks good. I like that. I like the fact that you get all your stone back as well. Instead of usually it's like quarter, quarter logs. Oh, yeah, that's because of that. Okay, let's get a door in this and see what it looks like when it's doored up. Ooh, that looks pretty. I mean, I like that. That is nice. That is... Let's get rid of that. We're going to end up junk everywhere. That looks good. I like that. I prefer this window than that window, though. It just looks better to to my, to my me. I, I kind of like it more. Let's see what else we can do. I'm just going to experiment a little bit more. All right. I think it's time we figure out how far we can get these stone struts to support. You know? I think... What is it? It's, uh, it's five wide for wood and let's see how far this will get us we're gonna go five wide i'm gonna bring it out down here and i just want to see how far we can get it all right so i have got six there so i'm gonna see if it will let me support all six i just want to see if it's stronger you know because i know wood can definitely do five i want to see if stone will support more if it can means we can build bigger bases here we go okay so i just found out that lobbing a rock actually hurts people so uh yeah be careful with your lo uh stone stone throwing i'm afraid sorry v but the test had to be done damage is on how many we got there too that's four this will be the fifth section oh, i cannot take that out oh maybe it's less because that's four. That would be the fifth. So it is less. I cannot take it out. But if I put that in there, I can take that out. It's not less, I mean. It's the same. It's the same as wood. So five wide. Oh, well, that's a shame. So we can't, we can't, do, uh, we can't do any more than that. There goes the giant buildings I was uh, hoping to do. Yeah. Oh, well, it is what it is. Doesn't matter. We've managed to test that out, which is good. Right. What else have they added? Let's have a little look. All right. So they've had it, uh, added a head trophy mount, which looks like to me it's just a stick. Let's find ourselves a wall. We'll stick it on the outside of the base. Uh, it's just a... It looks, just looks like it's... Uh, yeah, it is. It's just a stick. What can I put on there? Can I put a cannibal head in there? I cannot. Right. I was, uh, I'm pretty sure we, I just murdered some cannibals around here somewhere. I'm going to go cut one of their heads off. I don't think I've got one on me. I do not. Okay. Let's have a little look. Let's go and find something. Right. Here we go. Trophy. Oh, you can trophy cannibal heads. <laughs> that looks great. Oh, money. Come here. Come here. Oh, v, you beat me to it. Oh, you blew his head off for me. Good girl. Let me see if I can get another one of them up. Right, here we go. Muddy's head. It stays. Oh, please don't rot. If it doesn't rot, that means we can get heads on there from every different cannibal that we kill. I, uh, oh, we need to wait till night time. See if I can get a cannibal with, like, fluorescent ink on him. If I can, how cool would that be? A glowy head on your wall. 
That looks good. I love it. That looks real good. Right. Let's go find some more stuff that we can build. Okay. So I've done a different variation there. I've done another door there. So I've got the old stone frame door and a door there. I've got a wood frame, stone up each side and a door. I like that. That looks nice. I've got another head. I stuck it there. So it looks like it does keep the face paint, which is nice. Which, what I'm going to do... Oh, dear God, V, you look a mess. What I'm going to do is I'm going to build a few of these. And then I'm going to switch it to night time. And then I will wait. You can barely see that. I'll wait for the old fluorescent guys to rock up. And we'll get some fluorescent paint heads on the wall. And we'll see if it stays. Right. My next test is, can you test? Can you put a Puffy's head on it? You cannot. You cannot put a Puffy's head. That's a shame. And I'm guessing you can't slaughter them either. Oh, well. Oh, that's a shame. I was hoping to get some... Maybe they can add that later. I was hoping you can get Puffy's on there. Still no fluorescent dudes, but I'm still waiting for them. Okay, so I'll just cut that guy's head off. The one with the... Uh, the one with the headlight. Um, but when you chop his head off, the headlight goes out, so you can't stick him on your wall. Which is a shame, because that would have been a good test. I'm going to put it on the wall anyway, to see if it will work. No, see? He loses his headlight. That is an absolute shame. Oh, well. That would have been great. I like that, though. Once you put a bit of wood down, you can just... Kind of fill it up like that. They now line up perfect, which is good. I don't know what you can do with that, but you can do all sorts of stuff with it, I suppose. There's bound to be a few things that you can mess around with leading into that. Right, I've got a fluorescent head. Why is that door open? These doors are glitchy. Right, we shut that. Probably Calvin. I've got a fluorescent head. Please glow. Yes, it glows. Oh, that is amazing. You can put fluorescent heads on your bloody spikes. I need to get more. I need to get more heads. Guys, come back. I want to be your friend. Oh, there's one. <laughs> there was another one around here. He had like a glowy white skull on his face. Now it's gone. Oh, that's gutting. Don't matter. I've got his mate. Right, there we go. Yeah, look at that. Works. Let me turn the contrast down and we'll see what it's like at night. Like, proper night. There you go. That's what it looks like at night time. Oh, that is cool. I love the fact that you can... Oh, it's bloody weather. I love the fact that you can have these fluorescent heads on your walls. That is so good. That is cool. Oh. Oh, come on. Okay, yeah, they rot. Why have head spikes when they're just going to rot? Like that. Now, that sucks. I don't like that. I want to be able to put human heads on my walls. That means my fluorescent ones are going to disappear. Oh. Okay. Well, I mean, it doesn't matter. Hopefully, they'll change that and would allow us to have human heads. Because I, I would like to not just have animal heads, but like human heads on my walls because it would look good right so we've tested out all that we need to get ourselves a golf cart because they're around here and they're in the game now so we need to go farm one we're gonna have to mess around with that this was gonna be just a building one but i really want to just mess around with the golf cart we can mess around with it properly later right got myself a glider i'm uh i'm gonna go around the island and I'm going to see if I can somehow manage to find myself a golf cart. Now, I feel like the other side of the island is probably the best bet for that. So I'm going to I'm gonna glide around there and have a little look. I know they've changed a lot of things on the other side of the island as well. They've added more lakes and ponds and stuff like that. So we'll just have a little flyby. We'll see what it looks like now. All right. I have found a golf cart. Um, mate, don't even bother. I'm on the golf course. If you're one, not the golf course, airfield. I figured to myself, I was flying over to the golf course. Why is there loads of little ponds? Like, why is there loads of little circles? 
What are they? What's all that about? I'm going to have to go check one out. Is that like pockets of water? Weird. I'm going to go check it out. Ah, oh, they are. They're just little ponds. Okay, so they've added those little ponds now. I think they've added a system as well. That if you drink dirty water, it makes you ill. Is that a frog? Have they, have they added frogs? Sounds like there's frogs. Yeah, so they've added uh, they've added dirty water now. So let's empty my canteen. It is empty because every time I log in, it's bloody empty for some reason. Let's fill it up and see what it looks like in our bag. It should just be like dirty water now. Let's have a look. Dirty water. 3D printed dirty water flask. Yeah, yeah, I can see it now. Right. I can hear a frog, but I can't friggin' see it. I'm going to see if I can find it. I found it. I found the frog. He's there. Can I kill it? Can, can we eat the frog? Oh, I killed it. I killed the frog. Where'd it go? I don't want to eat it. Cannot eat it. Right, okay. I'm going to head back down to the golf cart now. And I am going to see about boiling up some water. Let's see what happens. So I'm trying to figure out how to boil the water. Um, I cannot get the dirty water out of my flask. Maybe if I put that pot on there first, then go like that, then get the dirty water out of the flask. Then put the... F can I do that? No, it didn't do anything. Right, can I... No, it just picks it up. What about if I push a button? Okay, so no, he just drinks it if you left click. If you right click, he tips it on the floor. <laughs> so you, there's a... Um... Okay, well, that's that makes no point. That's no sense. That literally makes no sense. I can get water in my flask, but I can't get the water out my flask and I see A, drinks it, or B, tips it on the floor. There's no other way of getting it into the... into the cooking pot. So I'm going to have to get some dirty water with the cooking pot. Okay, so I just put a dirty water pot uh, on there. And I exited the screen. And it just basically done the noise as if I was kind of going to do something to it. So I'm assuming it's just... Hold on. I'm assuming it's just boiling itself now. It should be done very soon. Don't run away, you big wimp. Come here. Oh, okay. So, just killed myself a rabbit. And, as you can see, I've got his head in my hand. Uh, interesting. Where does that go? Where does the... Uh, I should go over here, surely. This is where all the trophy stuff... I don't know where it goes. It'll be in my bag somewhere. I'm going to have a little look around. Do I find myself a little rabbit's head? I mean, it's quite small, isn't it? So, it's going to be hard to find. Right, let's see. I can't find it in my bag. So, I'm guessing it just goes into its own slot. There it is. <laughs> it's a little rabbit's head above the fireplace. My God, the amount of deer that die at my base. Right, so I've boiled the water now. That should just be clean. Yeah, clean cooking, clean water. Drink it now. And push the wrong button. After all that, I just tipped it on the floor. God damn it. Right, let's have a little mess. Oh, okay. No! Stop! Okay, so that's obviously to get it unstuck. Here we go. Right, here we go. Car time. How do you drive it? Oh, I'm going to see if I can reassign those keys. Okay, so I found the first bug, guys. Do not, and I repeat, do not try to reassign the keys for your vehicles because... You get stuck in a menu screen like me and I cannot change it because it's basically as if I'm not here right now. There's nothing I could do. So I'm going to have to hard exit the game and come back. All right. So <laughs> game crashed because I tried to change the keys and now I had to reload it. But it turns out I didn't save it. So I've had to rebuild what I've already built again. So there's the designs. And I've just remembered as well, they've actually added shutters to the game. But I don't know how to make shutters. 
I think I'm going to have to look into that a little bit. Let me check my book. Okay, so to make shutters, just, uh, just, oh, just let me miss this guy completely. Don't worry, guys. I'll use your head a bit later. I feel like I'm going to add it to my wall once I get those uh, little display things back up and running. Don't run away. Bye. Right, so yes, to make shutters, basically cut the wood down into quarters. Turn it into firewood as you normally would. And then that's the that that can't be it, surely. I think it's dependent on the size that you cut the wood. But I've just got a lot of rude people around here at the moment. Just proper mess. Right, do you know what? Okay, so the windows. Eh. Can't seem to get the shutters any bigger than what they are. I'm afraid. I mean, they look all right. I might need to turn them around. They're cut, I mean, it, it doesn't really... <laughs> doesn't really fit properly. Um, no, it doesn't fit at all, does it? That looks, that looks a bit of a mess. Let's make it from the inside so I can open them outwards. Question. Can I lock them? You don't need to lock them because it's right. Okay, no, you don't need to stick a lock on them. Oh, I was just trying. So we're looking at that. Okay, so we've got shutters. Um, you can't make them any bigger from what I can tell. Let's make this window slightly lower. See if we can get them in here. Just to test it out. Right, so this is a half one. No, nothing. I can't get them in. It only does it with quarters. Uh, it's a good addition for now. Not the best. I'm assuming that we can change that. Right. Let's go get our asses on a golf cart. All right, we're back at the cart. Again, whatever you do, do not try and rechange the bloody keys. So we're in. How do we drive? WASD, I'd assume. Whoa, my God. Can I can I jump this? Can I, obviously, I can't. No buttons, right. All right, this is... Uh... B. <laughs> can I run cannibals over? That's the question. It's almost like the uh, the Knight Rider, but four wheels. <laughs> Roadkill! Yes! Cue the carnage music! <laughs> Come on! Anybody else want some? Is there a horn? Oh, it would have been so much better if there was a horn. Everyone knows a car or some sort of golf cart needs a horn. Wow, that, that, that stops. Like, stop, stops. As soon as you push the back, it... Jesus. That really stops. Ready? <laughs> Stop standing in its track. How'd you get out? G. No. R. E. Q. I can't get out. Interact. Ah, there we go. Woof. Done it. I like that. That is fun. I'm uh, going to have to drive that around a little bit. We're going to have to test this out. I'm going to go find a big eel. I'll be right back. All right. So you can't use your map when you're in it. But yeah, to be honest, it doesn't really matter, does it? Oh, it's going to be a bit of a nightmare, I think, going off land. But and it looks like it runs by battery, which is cool. It's basically, yeah, the night five, but four wheels. Oh, man, we're going to have to do a proper, proper funny video oh damn it a uh, proper video on this later on down the line i like the way it controls actually i prefer this then the uh oh okay so you can't can't drive it in the water but it does float and you can bounce it across the water <laughs> look at that <laughs> come on up you go come on up oh no uh oh don't roll back in let's see if i can get up this hill uh, go. I mean, it's quite powerful. I mean, you know where I'm going with it, don't you, really? You know where I'm going. I'm going to head over to the, the old cliffs and uh, see if I can... Bloody hell, see if I can drive up the mountain. All right, well, that's a shame. I think I broke it. Uh, It's no longer working for me. <laughs> Screw you, crappy thing. Ah, uh, I was hoping to drive it. I'll see if I find another one. All right, got my hands on another golf cart. I had to go all the way over to the bloody golf course to find one. I mean, what better place can you find one than at a golf course, right? 
I uh, oh. <laughs> just want to drive it around a little bit and see what it's like. I want to see how good it is against places. I'm only messing around at the moment, so. Oh, crap. Does it all go right? Come on. Come on. I'll, I'll just, come on. Come on. Well, that's a position, isn't it? How did I even get into that? Okay. okay. This is not how you drive a golf cart. <laughs> this is... This is... Just, can you tell I can't drive in real life? Jesus Christ. Oh, oh, oh it's making me feel sick. Oh. Nailed it. <laughs> Bloody hell. That was a bit of a nightmare, wasn't it? Right. Oh, dear. Okay. Oh, there's one thing I forgot to show you guys. Is you can actually send all sorts of stuff. No, no, stop, stop. Just stay there. You can actually send uh, stones and different types of uh, like logs and stuff up and down the zip wire now. So if I do that, don't ask. I don't know how that would work in a million years, but it does. And then you can just keep sending them up. That's a bit stupid. But it works, so uh, I'll, I'm not going to moan. Uh, you can send up logs now of all different types. Let me sh I'll show you. So we've got a half log here. So pop. Yeah, you can send half logs. Oh, oh, or you can take it off as it's on its way up. Oh, my days. Stop picking it up, you absolute nutcase. And you can send a quarter log. I don't know why. I don't think you can actually store them anymore, like, into the holders. Right, let me see if we can store these. I don't think we can. Nah, you can't store them. I think it's just for the purpose of building. Like, just getting things back and forth. Which is a shame, because I w if they could allow us to... Uh, what? Oh, I'm in the passenger seat. <laughs> oh, please let Calvin get in this. Oh, that would be amazing. Oh, it's broke again. It's frozen. Oh, okay, that's got to be a bug. That has to be a bug. All right. Well, I mean, it's got a solar panel on it, so it obviously self-charges. Oh, well, that's a shame, isn't it? I was hoping that we could uh, drive that around a little bit more, but I could do a video on that at a later date, so I'm going to leave this one here. Oh, also, they're setting up so you can have, like, servers for it now. So I am thinking of setting up a server for the community. Uh, it'll be a private Patreon server, so if you're interested, link to the Patreon site will be in the description. So feel free to head over if you like. Um, so I'm going to be setting one of them up as soon as I can. So I'm going to leave this one here. We've had a good look at the building system. I kind of like how it is. I like how it's working. Can't wait to play with it a bit more. Cannot wait to play with this a bit more. Also, there's a new gun in the game, but I haven't got my hands on it yet. But I can just do a video on that another time. So thanks for coming, guys. Thanks for watching. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see some more, subscribe. And I've got Discord. Link is in the description. Uh, thanks for coming. Bye.